With the acquisition of top wide receiver Tyreek Hill, the Miami Dolphins will become the masters of yards after catch. Yards after catch will become the greatest tool in the Finns' arsenal. The Legion of Zoom will be outrunning their defensive counterparts. The Dolphins were 25th last season in yards after catch, they had 1,714 yards for the year. With new coach Mike McDaniel it is expected this stat will see a huge increase. The 49ers were 8th in the league for this stat, they gathered 2,264 yards after the catch. Jalen Waddell is expected to see lighter coverage with Hill now getting well-deserved attention drawn towards him. The hope is this leads to more open space for Waddle's game-breaking speed to show up during game day. All-pro wideout Debo Samuel was second in the league with 768 yards after the catch. Before last season Samuel's best season in this category was 473 yards. McDaniel needs to get into his lab and concoct a diabolical offensive scheme that uses the full potential of the weapons found on this new revamped receiving core. Even Hill is excited about what is in store for him within the McDaniel offense. In a Miami Dolphins podcast, Hill said about McDaniel as he can't help me get drunk off of yards after catch. Hill continued about his interaction with the new head coach who told him, gear up, it's going to be fun. While being tempered on expectations is reasonable, it is also reasonable to be excited for what this offense can become. Super Bowl winning head coach Sean McVay said about the Dolphins' offensive potential, it's going to be scary. McVay coached with McDaniel in Washington and has said before that he knows how to utilize his players well within the offense. While the Finns haven't started OTAs yet the hype surrounding this team feels legit. The organization has seemingly done everything by the book when building this roster. Initially building through the draft, once they felt they had enough young talent they decided to spend big in free agency. The only thing left is to prove it on the field.